I'm Stephen Baxter. I'm a resident of Fullerton. Mayor? Gentlemen, um, so I've heard a lot of stuff here while I've been waiting, and I'd have to comment on a few of those. Jason Schoen, is that his name? Um, at least that's how it's spelled. What he called a mistake was a murder. What this last gentleman said, buses brought homeless people here. An ambulance brought a comatose homeless person away from here also. You know, let's not forget that all this backbone and all this courage that we're talking about, that they're patting themselves on the back for. Like a year ago, the courage that it took for a lot of other people to step up, that have a respect for the law, that have a respect for the police, and to say what they did to Kelly Thomas was wrong, that took some real courage because, you know, we don't have guns. You know, we can't get stopped. We get stopped randomly by these guys. The homeless guys that came out and supported us, they don't even have a door to close. But they had the courage to speak up against the police that did this to Kelly and against the leadership that let them get away with it. So I was here a couple weeks ago, and I love the new civic-minded sea of blue that we're seeing. But I want to know, where were they when the Boy Scouts were getting on board? Where were they when there was a vote on Coyote Hills? Where are they when a project is getting green-lighted? Where are they then? They show up only when their paycheck is on the line. 48-year-old pensioners worried about their own money, that's when they show up in force. Fullerton has become a paycheck to them, not a community. Fullerton has become a methadone clinic for their sea dues. They all got beautiful tans, don't they? 60 hours a week, please. When I work 60 hours a week, I don't get overtime, kids. All right? So let me just tell you this. We like that you're involved, finally. But get involved on an issue that doesn't directly affect your paycheck and maybe will pay attention. Seriously. Because all I see so far is selfish behavior. In mass. So, I was here last week. And someone told me to watch my back. You're all watching my back right now, and I appreciate it. But you know what? We hate you guys to watch our backs collectively. So thank you for doing that, and please tell your force, whoever it was. I don't know if it was a cop or just a cop groupie, but I don't need to watch my back because I'm not doing anything wrong. All right? I'm sticking up for a kid who was murdered, who was homeless, who was schizophrenic. And I didn't see any of this sea of blue when 60 year old murdered him. Murdered him slowly over the course of 45 minutes. You taunted with him, <coughs> you mocked him, you humiliated him, and then you killed him. And guess what? You show up a year later because your paycheck's on the line. Thanks, everybody. Yeah.